Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in. Alessandro the Crypto here. I hope you're doing all fine. So before we start with today's TA and have a look on the continuation of this pump on Bitcoin, I first have to announce that Bybit is making a new trading competition similar like we had one year ago when we had like a team where we could uh, trade together and uh, win a prize pool and this time it's called WSOT World Series of Trading and this event is coming up uh, next month and you still have time to pre-register to the event because if you pre-register you can get some early bird bony like $60 and here also a welcome reward of $90 so make sure that you register in time if you're interested if, or if you're planning to participate i will add the link down below here in the video description to sign up and pre-register to the event also there are some other prizes to win and the big prize pool is worth of 150 bitcoins i have already uh, the confirmation from uh, bybit that i my team is registered so watch out for the team the cryptos avengers this is the name of our team so if you're interested to join once you register it uh, make sure that later on when you see the teams you sign up to my link i will share all the details also later on uh, discord so make also sure to join the free discord trading chat you find the link down below here in the video description as well so have fun guys and let's see if we can win here the prize pool of 150 bitcoins and make sure that you register already now to get this early bird bony but later on also you will be able to register as well and now let's start with our daily ta because uh, first off shout out to all the discord trading members because yesterday we had this uh, falling wedge here and we talked about that a breakout is coming up pretty soon and uh, we scaled in our longs down to the 20 moving average in the four hour unfortunately we didn't came down to test it really so we didn't test here the bottom again of this falling wedge so only a couple of orders got executed here and uh, i think my trade is now over 50 percent in profits uh, here on btr the ones on the bybit didn't get executed uh, because on Bybit you have to trade with cryptos you can trade Bitcoin Ethereum EOS or XRP and when I trade with Bitcoin here I usually do bigger trades uh, and on BTR I do smaller trades with the US dollar tether and here I have only a small uh, percentage of uh, my tether portfolio that I put in here but with high leverage so this trade here I put only $35 with 40x leverage it's uh, worth almost $1,500 uh, with only putting in $35 and currently we are uh, more than 50% in profits only because of this move that we have seen uh, yesterday and we also called it out in the disco trading chat and I know some of you are sitting in nice profits right now so congratulations and also now it looks like that Bitcoin is forming another similar pattern like here so watch out here for a little retracement like we had over here if you still want to open up a long position because we are still far away from our target up here towards uh, $9,900 as you can see i also took here i take profits of nine thousand eight hundred dollar to close the trade automatically at this level here there is a chance that we could also break from it but most likely here at least at the beginning we will see a possible rejection here because this is still a very huge resistance up here only if we are able to break it here and also start to trade again above ten thousand dollar then i think we could uh, re-enter in with a long position but in case that we're getting rejected here i wouldn't short it but maybe at least put a stop loss or close your long position if you entered down here so here in the one hour it looks like that we're having another little retracement after topping out here at 9580 so watch out here for a possible 20 moving average retest towards nine thousand four hundred dollar if you want to enter a long position because currently we are overbought in the stochastic and rsi if we have a look on the bollinger band after overshooting into the upside we are retracing back here into the middle area so watch out here uh, till we're going to reach here this nine thousand four hundred dollar level also macd could have a bearish cross here and if we go over here into the four hour time frame 
you can see that also here after overshooting it to the upside again we are retracing back down here but we're still here in the upper area so we're still in the bullish side MACD shifted to the upside if we switch over to the bitstamp chart i'm sorry we were already in the four hour time frame so let's also quickly have a look on the one hour because here in the one hour also we are retracing back towards the 20 moving average all the stochastic and rsi are cooling off already so here in the lower time frames we are already cooling off so watch out for this area here there are 9400 for our time frame we already covered before and now let's go over to the daily time frame because here we are still very bullish right now we still are trading above the 50 and 20 daily moving average a possible retest towards 9400 is also possible here but since we closed now the last two days here above the 20 and 50 i think we should be good to go to retest here this 10k area up here we have the stochastic coming up into overbought condition but here we also can stay for a very long time and rsi is still above the 50 and not yet overbought so here also we have a lot of room to the upside and that's why i'm still very bullish and confident that we're gonna test here this 9900 dollar and here we're gonna have to see if we're able to break it or not and if we have a look here on the bollinger band in the daily you can see that we're still overshooting it to the upside so our retracement back down here is very likely maybe not necessarily down to 9260 but at least towards here the 9400 to cool off here a bit and get back into the Bollinger Band. MACD still shifted to the upside here so even though we could see a little pullback here I still think $9,900 is very likely to come and also if we're gonna have a look in the weekly time frame here we're still very bullish trading above the 20 and 50 weekly moving average as you can see currently we're taking out also the highs that we had here in the last couple of weeks let's hope that we can take out also this one here $9,900 this would also mean that we will break here the main resistance and that could see signal a big uh, push here to the upside to maybe retest even 12 14 000 in the next couple of days but this is what we have to see once we're going to test and break this area here and if we have a look on the bollinger band in the weekly here also we're still trading in the upper area and the target here to reach the top is towards eleven thousand dollar so i think it is very likely that maybe we even see eleven thousand dollar in the next couple of days if we are able to break this nine thousand nine hundred dollar and hopefully also create a support above uh, 10k the midline here is towards eight thousand three hundred dollars so i think if we're gonna have a major dump or something this area here is what we have to watch out and maybe open up some longs here at around eight thousand dollar macd is also still shifted to the upside so here in the weekly everything is still looking very very bullish and now since we are in the bigger time frames let's have a look also on ethereum because ethereum currently is breaking a significant resistance line this green line that you see coming down here this is a very old one that is lasting here from the top that we had at 370 dollars and currently you can see that we are breaking this resistance and also here in the weekly we still have some room left to the upside only if we go over into the smaller time frames you can see like here in the daily that we're already getting overbought after this push here to the upside but this is a very important push and in case that you want to trade this also for example over on bybit with a long or you want to buy some more ethereum watch out maybe for a retest and a confirmation that the old resistance line is now new support and this is right now around at 250 dollars so watch out for this entry in case that you still want to take this trade or you want to buy some more ethereum and if we zoom out here you can see that the target in case of a possible breakout here to the upside is at least to retest here this area up here at around 300 to 350 dollars so this is what i think we could see on ethereum like a 100 dollar move here to the upside in case that this breakout here is valid and we're gonna see a big spike here to the upside towards old resistance and support points so watch out here for the 300 to 350 dollar level in case that this breakout is going to play out and it's still not too late to trade it in case that you want to enter already now with a long or buy some more ethereum you can already scale in your longs or buy in right now but if you want the perfect entry then wait here for the retest of 250 
dollars although around 255 to 250 something like this we could see in the next couple of hours so it's up to you if you want to take this trade or not and of course on bybit you can also trade ethereum so make sure if you want to trade ethereum to sign up to bybit you find the sign up link also down below here in the video description with my link you can get some rewards some bony and also you support the channel so with that said guys i'm gonna wrap it up for now don't forget also to sign up to the 10 dollar worth of bitcoin giveaway the subscription video is popping up at the end of this video so make sure to leave a comment and your bitcoin address over there to participate on our 10 dollar worth of bitcoin weekly giveaway sponsored by BTR. BTR is the exchange where you can trade with tether all the coins that you see over here without even have one of these uh, coins with tether you can trade all of them also leave a like if you like the content subscribe to the channel here if you have twitch i have all the twitch channel you find also the link down below here and don't forget also to subscribe to the world series of trading the next event over on bybit thank you very much for watching my friends i'm heading now to the beach best regards from italy and we see us all in the next one happy trading bye